guys. We are in Frank Bay today visiting Coconut Coast Studios. It's just a five minute walk from the ferry dock and we're gonna head inside to meet the artist herself, Elaine Estern. to take a look around this gallery. So Elaine, can you tell me a little bit about the history of Coconut Coast Studios and your journey to St. John? Sure. The gallery has been open now over 25 years in this location the whole time. Wow, and have you been interested in art the entire time? No, no. I've had four professions. One is a mother, which you'll always have. And then I became, I had a Montessori school I had it in California first, and then I came down here to help a friend run hers. Ended up buying her school and running the school. So I taught for, I think, 15 years. And then I got interested in um, emergency medicine and started and became an EMT and then a paramedic. And then I was transferred. What an exciting path. So how did all of that translate into painting? Well. While I was waiting in St. John for ambulance calls, this is 30 years ago, there was no television, there was no internet, there was very few books of which I read them all. And so I was very bored and I needed to do something, so I started painting. And then I retired early and did it full time. That's so cool. What materials do you use to paint? Only watercolor on paper, that's all I do. Okay, they're so beautiful. Do you want to show me maybe some of your favorites or, I know they're all great, so whichever ones you want to talk about. Sure, look um, right here behind us. So my favorite painting in the gallery at the moment is Garden Under the Sea, this painting here. It's got the little spotted drum and of course the turtle that we all love to swim with. And my favorite fish happens to be the gray angels. Also, I framed it in something very unique. It's framed in Mother of Pearl. And um, I've never seen this kind of frame before, so with suede. So this is my favorite one at the moment. So this would be another one of my favorites. It's a, again an underwater painting, but it's from Coral Bay. And where the dive site is, it's called Eagle Shoals. Jillian, I'd like to introduce you to Jen. She's my assistant. And she'll show you around the rest of the gallery. So Jillian, this is our gift room. We have lots of gifts available. They're reproductions of Elaine's originals. We have magnets. We have giclés and prints. We have print-sized tiles. We have the small tiles, turtle tiles, and fish tiles, coasters. We also have got cards, gift cards, mouse pads. Uh, Elaine wrote a book. She wrote a book about Daisy the Duck. It is one of my favorite books. When I was a teacher, I used to read it to my students. Isn't it fantastic? Oh my gosh, it's so wonderful. And it's a true story about her and the puppies and the, and the duck that imprinted on them. Followed them all over the island. This is such a nice outdoor area we've entered. It's so bright and peaceful. What do you guys use it for? This is actually our outdoor kitchen space. We use this during our cocktail parties that we have during high season. It starts the first week in November and goes until the last week of April. We love for people to come and visit. We have cocktails and music and hors d'oeuvres and we just have a really good time. Sounds like a really nice party. Thank you so much for showing me around today. Thank you so much for coming, Jillian. We really enjoy having you here. All of our items are U.S. made, and we would love for people to come down and visit us anytime. 